Hey people, welcome, hello to Space Loth. Uh, I'm back to a sci fi game. I enjoyed the first time I played, so I will, you know, just keep playing it until I got my battleship destroyed. Sounds like a plan, I suppose. Ooh, give me a second though. Okay, I have to check where I was because I don't remember. Ah, okay, uh, it's it's the final the final sector uh, from the introduction. <laughs> so we are at the first system. It's the entrance. Maybe I should get this a bit lower. Okay. Okay, close the map. So we have two, we have five people here, five officers. I remember Yuki was the best one. He did like any mission. We have six fuel for six jumps. Sixty scrap. That's not that's not much. And sixteen guys to do our expedition for us. Okay, so let's start. Oh, I forgot about that, sorry. So, ah, uh, we need... We need this quest. So... We have to plot her out around it so we can get there. I'm not sure what this is. Talk to the Neon Child. Oh yeah, as I've said in the first part of uh, this playthrough, I found uh, a pirate and I kind of, maybe I blackmailed him a bit to give me the location of uh, a certain NPC which uh, knows the location of the leader of all pirates. It's the mother. So let's plot her out and uh, let's get there so one two three one two three four one two three one two three four yeah, i'll go a straight line yeah. let's start let's have fun I made the mistake in the first part of the uh, of the first stream of this game, and I said that this game is a pixel game, which is which is untrue. Vertex uh, corrected me. It's a pixelesque game, which which resembles a pixel game. It's a totally 3D game, though. Okay, we are in uh, normal signal. The records. Of an Aki ship, sir. Some of the easiest scrap we ever gonna find. Can't say no to that. We'll take it, of course we will. Ooh, six. Okay, sixty-two. It's a nice start. Two fuel, so we are now at seven. Yes, it's a positive. I can. Yeah, I can understand that. Thanks for the heads up though. Okay, local system map. What do we have here? So, we had the, the sun, we got the fuel. Let's go to the, to the expedition. Appears to be a nominee, okay. Uh, Okay, give us some fluff. What kind of planet is this? Its name suggests this is a planet where Omnis were one manufactured in enormous factories. Plan like this could be found in virtually every 
every sector before the shutdown. Depending on the Omni quota established by Oberon, a certain number of Omnis would be pro produced in those factories, then shipped to their respective destinations. Okay. The distribution and the production of positronic chips, which as you know contain the Rubicon, was more closely guarded. The Rubicon is the thing that we get fuel from the sun. Uh, can I ask more? Ask where the positronic chips were manufactured. Okay. Where the chips were made. The positronic chips were only produced in a terminus cluster in the Telos Dominion. This was done by design, give Oberon more control over chip production and distribution. Essentially, if you wanted the positronic chip, the brain of a nominee, you had to travel to the terminus to get it. This always irritated the other house. Okay, yeah, because Telos was, was yes, the best house of uh, the empire we're playing. And uh, kind of I am. I represent this house, I suppose, I'm not sure. Uh, let's ask about the quota. Maintain a perpetual harmony in the Empire, Eberon created and enforced Omni Quota depending on the house and whether it was a minor or major, it received a certain number of chips. Oh yeah, the quota is... Uh, each house was getting paid for some money. Uh, every 10 years, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've, I've read it, I know enough, so, you say so, what do you want to do about this planet, uh, attempt to communicate with the planet, yes, let's communicate, lieutenant, see if you can make the contact, go on lieutenant, okay, no luck, Oh, so we can't do anything? Really? Yay! So much for the fuel, yes! At least we tried. Can we upgrade anything? I mean, I, we have 122. Heat capacitor. This is not bad, increase maximum heat capacity of all system. It means that it will sustain a bit more damage before it take before it take damage to the hull. So yeah, I give it one and we are good, okay, keep, keep 80. So ah there is the expedition. I thought we were leaving. Yeah, prepare. <clears throat> okay. Uh, major threat. We can be ambushed. Okay. Secret military base is one artifact, and the other artifact is located in an abandoned auto factory. Uh, those two guys are our best bet so far. Okay. Uh, Marcia Caras uh, will come back safely, will extract between 71 and 100%. That's not bad. And she will lose 1 to 8 commandos. Uh, Hiro Yun, Hiro Yun, whatever, will uh, return safely as well. She will, he, she, whatever, she, maybe, whatever, uh, will extract between 68 and 100, which is good, and uh, she will lose a, a little less men. And um, she's a bit better, she's a spy, whether, whether Marcia is a soldier, but as a spy, she has all three skills available. So I will uh, pick here. Let's see what happens. Okay, they travel to the planet. And they just found the auto, auto factory. Ok, 
Okay, so they succeeded, we got scrap, good news. And here we got ambushed. Okay, we did it. I mean, we lost one guy, but just one. We, we talked our way out of here. We got some resources. Come on, this is good. I don't know, continue, I mean, very good job so far. We found the military base, not so secret. Frigate Mark III Magneto. Yeah, I'm not sure what Magneto is, but give it to me. No need to retreat, just go on. Oof, oof. Okay, we've lost three guys. Still, she is okay. Okay, this was a good run. I mean, we got some scrap, we got uh, a squadron, and just lost three, lost three commandos. Okay, let's see what what this is. The magneto, yeah. Passive. All enemy units able to target this unit are forced to do so, and all adjacent enemies cannot move. Okay, so this is a tank type of squadron. It obviously need escort for that, but. If you have this around the area uh, of your battleship where uh, it re regenerates the squadrons, uh, it's a good way to fire your weapons up upon the enemies. I mean, you know where they will fight. Okay, I, I don't dislike that. Oops. Anyhow, we will see. You can ask that improve color repair time in hangar. Okay. Oh, so this is my battleships. Uh, passive. Okay, I got it. Okay, we did something here. If we are lucky enough, we can go here, and instead of jumping here, we can climb to this system and this system after that, okay. We just need to tweak the if we are lucky enough because I usually am not a lucky guy. See, I'm picking a weak, a weak distress transmission from the escape pod. If you are getting this, I need your help. My pod's engine has conked out and now I'm on high velocity collision course with the ship eater. Uh, what is the ship eater? Wait a minute. You received my transmission. Yes, and we are going to try to help you, but I have to ask, what do you mean by ship eater? Yeah, that's exactly what I mean. There's a powerful gravitational singularity not too far from here. See, Peter is just how it's known informally, you know, because it's uh, shallowed many ships. Just like my ex did. Okay, I was assisting a group of Omni studying it. I think they were interested in harvesting its energy. Okay. Anyway, when they collapsed, I nearly went crazy living on my own for too long. I am passing through the same shit in uh, lockdown, believe me. But somehow managed to survive at our research station until my food ran out. What are you eating, man? That's when I escaped in the escape pod uh, with its old engine. I was in here about the day when the engine failed me and well, you know the rest, yes. Okay, uh, what can I do to help you, man? 
In short, get, get me off this pod, okay. A skilled pilot, if they use their thrusters precisely, could stabilize the rescue pod long enough to pull me out without getting pulled in by the gravitational field. Okay, so he, for some reason, he doesn't think that I am a battleship and he's an escape pod, and he, for some reason he doesn't ask me to join <laughs> to join the battleship, so he gets saved saved like one hundred percent. He just wants to tweak their course so they can leave. Say we could enhance our short red structure beam, it could be enough to pull the pod away. Yeah, just do But it will require using some scrap. 30 scrap for the guy. Okay, so if I pay some scraps, there, are, there is a 50 50 percent chance to win it. But if we lose, the guy does not succeed to escape and I lose the scrap. Ask specialist officer to get close enough to pod rescue. Yes, I will, um, I will ask my officers to do it. Can I count on you to get close enough to that pod to extract the passenger? Thomas. Thomas is a failure, uh, but he did like, I think one or two. Uh, missions and he failed horribly. Absolutely, sir. I've trained for missions like this countless time in our simulators. <laughs> Mostly with success. Okay, yes. Get it done, Lieutenant. We are counting on you. Well, we are not. The guy in the pod is for sure. Not sure. I would have used the same approach angle to be honest, but your pilot pulled it off. Okay, good job Thomas. I can't thank you enough for saving me, you know I'm pretty skilled in my domain. If you'll have it, I'd gladly join your ship. I didn't get to choose though, he just jumped in, but uh, welcome Omar Young. You have too many officers. Yeah, right. Uh, so, Omari Young will act as having the same ability. Okay, uh, he is a scientist. So let's see about our scientists. Thomas Lima is a soldier. Peggy Ahmad is a scientist. Yuki is staying on board, I don't care anymore. He's the best uh, officer I had. Okay, so the problem here is that I don't want to change my officers. I have one, two soldiers, one scientist, and two spies. And his passive isn't something that I would get. I mean, he will act as having the same ability as the officer currently deployed in the previous support. Yeah, it's nice if you get to change the officers. Okay. Um, you can continue to drop down. Oh, sorry, man. You stay out until I, I I need him. Maybe I'm not sure if I can change them. If I want to change them, I don't think I can. Anyhow, let's cavens uh, for fuel. Okay. To fuel back, that's that's normal. Let's see. Ejected cryopod. We will go here first, and then we will get to to the anomaly.
Transmission from this cargo ship. Oh, they are not enemies. I'll try to keep the sword. We are transport transporting a Zeno. There is a collector around here. You probably guessed it, but it got loose, and thanks to that, good captain who triggered it before jumping ship, we also have an activated self destruction countdown. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be in his boots right now. Ask what the Zeno is. I think I can get what the Zeno is. Some kind of alien beast or something. Ask what can I do to help? Yeah, let's help everyone we meet because we are so good. We are sense. Kill the Zeno that got loose on our ship or distract her at least so we can get off before the ship goes boom. You seem like a reasonable guy. Don't jump to conclusion, man. We got the ship full of cargo. We got able bodies. You help us, we help you. Okay, now start. It starts to look like a deal. So my options are send commandos to save smugglers. Send commandos not to save smugglers crew, but to grab cargo. Ask a specialist to disable the self destruction. Yeah, this is the safest option, I suppose. I mean. I don't risk any commandos. Peggy Ahmad. I don't see why not, Admiral Smugglers? No, I can't imagine we are dealing with a sophisticated mainframe here, but let me take yeah, a rose to them. <laughs> Child's play, well done. I've Stop the countdown, of course. The Zeno is still somewhere on the ship. The situations remain the same. Okay. So, now it changed to send commandos in to save smuggler and grab the cargo. Yeah, I will bet on that. Kill the beast and rescue the crew captain. No one deserves to be a Zeno food. My team is putting on their full tactical gear as we speak, sir. Best not to leave any exposed skin in a situation like this. Yeah. Sounds like a great idea. Pew pew pew. Pew pew pew. The beast has been eradicated, sir. Just a three ton baby. Who knows <laughs> what that smuggler was crying about? <laughs> we are evacuating the smuggler, sir. Should be longer. You stuck out our neck for us, Admiral. Yeah. As a show of thanks, some of us would like to join your ship. Uh, I hope you mean commandos because I'm full of officers. One of us even has some real skill. <laughs> also, there is a squadron we were transporting. Should help you in battle. Okay. He's like Santa Claus. We got four commandos. Parasite drones, whatever this is, and Thomas Ivanov. So, Thomas, weapons are loading time. He's a soldier. His passive is uh, that he reloads uh, weapons must fast a bit faster. And the best thing from that is that I'm checking the wrong guy all this time. So let's go to actual Thomas Ivanov. Here he is. So this guy is a, a scientist. His passive applies to weapons though. It's the same, uh, the same thing. And he ha where are my scientists here? So she has the last two skills. And she's here taking care of the hull. I mean, I cannot change here with this guy. Soldier. Yeah, no. So, Thomas, you are out, man. 
sorry. Okay, let me see what those, those drones are. Parasitize. Gain control of attacked unit and disappear. Doesn't work on already parasitized units. Charge. Only when attacking an enemy unit, cancel taking damage. So, gain control of attacked unit. I could have the tanking uh, frigate and gates with uh, a squadron and those drones just taking over the squadron this is what I understand I'm not sure that it works like that okay uh, let's prepare for the mission what's the mission again? Artifacts, uh, ejected cryopod and one in abandoned auto factory. Oof, uh, no one is eligible for that. I mean, maybe this one is. Okay, I uh, will give it a try, but uh, I will consider retreats very much at this one. Let's see. Uh, he has not the fight. He's discreet. Let's go. We find the cryopod. And we did nothing with it. Okay, do the last part, whatever, they're still uh, alive. Sandworm, you can fight it and people will die here. Oh. But still, uh, still we had uh, the new guys. I know that's a bit cruel to say, but... Yes, yes, okay, 68 scrap, not bad. Waiting for extraction, okay. Four losses, 110 scrap. Okay, whatever. Sorry, guys. Let's see the anomaly and jump system. Yeah. I'm in this sector to do two things. Snort Neo and Powder. That's good. And destroy battleships. And I'm all out of Neon Powder. Yeah. Okay. So we need to... Let's check first. Uh, he has just one officer with a passive ability for the squadron speed. He has drones. Boomer drones. Okay, Boomer. Deals 18 damage to all adjacent units. Yeah, those might need to go with a, a range squadron of mine. A good fighter, Mark 3, and 
uh, the same. Okay, yeah, we will have a problem here. This is the longbow. Okay, this is the long range. Okay, let's see if this works. I'm not 100 sure, but... Okay, and we have a debuff as well. Space instability. Any unit going through or being hit by space instability will be teleported at least 4 cells away in a direction. Okay, so this is uh, <laughs> the space instability. Okay, longbow should be back. Frigate, magneto should be here. And uh, let's put them here. Okay, let's start. Oh. Do we need to take the drones back? need to bring this thing here hey you come here and you come okay Use them in my favor. Okay, those guys should go. Uh, I don't really like that there are drones from the part of the enemy, I mean if I get to claim them as my own, they do have damage in battleships, it's, it's not much. fire come on okay we have some problems so let's see Okay, I failed horribly. Oh, old school tactics. Fighters. Uh, my fighters are very, very bad.
Okay. Not as planned. One blade down. Fuck. Okay, we're not doing great. Guys, we can only target a light unit. So, this is what happens. They send uh, squads of drones, they fire on them, they destroy the unit on target cell and deal 25 plus 50 percent of its current health as damage. So, they actually do increase damage for that. It wasn't that hard, but I should have read that. <laughs> okay, no problem. At least we have a lot of scraps. Probably, problem is that we cannot repair right now. Can still buy some ammo, some new fuel. Okay. Chain reaction cannon. It's not bad. Jumps to adjacent units, so it does 30 damage. Yeah, this is for battlefield only. But if it has a lot of uh, a lot of enemy units around it, it jumps from one to the other. Yeah, but in ah yeah, they have to be close to each other. And sub zero gun. Uh, if it's a Mortal Kombat or ended, I know what happens. Stops movement, attacks. And ability charging of units on target cells. Yeah. Okay, I'm more interested in this one. I could get rid of this. I mean, it's a good weapon, but uh, I'm not good at it. Yeah, we'll get rid of this. I uh, will take the chain reaction and try to use it. Okay. Let's see our upgrades. Okay, we have the maximum weapons, additional weapon dogs. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have sold that because I could have all three of them. And this is good as well. I mean, four dogs, yes. 
but uh, I'm, not, I'm not the money. Okay, maybe I should focus a bit on this one because uh, if I die a lot, I get to put out some uh, some squadrons more more quickly. Yeah, that's enough. Okay, we did something. Are we done? Yes, we are done here. Oof. Yeah, now I'm fooling a bit around. Maybe I shouldn't. Come on, church battles, the battleship. I doesn't believe so. I don't believe so. In those rocks, its visibility must be slim to none. <clears throat> Okay, our options are uh, ask the robot if we can attack, continue or your next destination, attack the ship risking damage from the asteroids, have a specialist officer redirect the asteroids into the enemy ship. Okay, I'm not sure how, how much of a specialist you should be to be able to redirect asteroids on something. Isn't that what God does? I mean, I play with things that we couldn't. Okay, I'm asking Caliban first. We could throw an environmental like this. We could sustain heavy damage doing so. There is another idea. If we have specialist officers skilled in demolition, oh, that's how we could do it. Okay, yes. We could blow some of these steroids in their battleship. Probably won't destroy it, but we would clip its wing a little. Then we can move on and finish the job. Yeah, that's interesting. So, yes. Now we are uh, attacking the, the church ship. I'm already in love that there is a church uh, battleship out there. I'm no meteorologist, sir, but I see an asteroid shower and an immediate forecast. Oh, shut up, you! You beautiful bastard! Just look at the significant hull damage and have a clear path to attack. Now, let's do a little zealot hunting, shall we? Doesn't that make us zealot? No, it doesn't. I like the way you think, yeah, okay. Prepare to fight the battle is imminent. Oh, something in, in favor of us. Damage. The enemy has sustained damage and will start the battle with a critical effect. And fire. Has sustained damage and will start the battle with a critical. Okay, let's go. I suspect that the fire critical effect should be fire. Go on. So, they cannot. They have to wait. One, two, three weapons? Really? What's happening? <laughs> I'm not sure what they do. They have frigates. Cruiser. Is this a uh, melee damage? No, yeah, this is a range. Okay. Stays in blink stays to hit enemies. Move at speed minus. Ooh, okay. Okay, uh, the church ship is probably focused around weapons. I think my main concern is to delay it as much as I can. Okay, to stop the frigate, I think I need drones. Yeah. And I want drones just to take the frigate. <laughs> Hopefully, this works. And fighter with a ghost ability. Okay, it's still a space instability here. What's this? Oh, wait. Nanobot repair field. What's this? Apply regen.
Okay. Uh, if we capture it, we get uh, the regeneration. And I think we need to capture it. So, yes, uh, the drones come here. I think this is the best speed uh, from my squadrons. Fighters here. And come here so you can just go and attack. Stop. Come here. Like now. Okay, now we have a problem because this is slowed down. I mean, it's already slow. Yeah, we have a problem because we need... Okay. We lost the second plate. True, what's happening again? Okay. Rough. Okay, we need something. fire here so the shield goes down
effect because I'm dumb. Okay, got it. Oh, we can. Okay, I'm not sure I will make it. I mean, I've I've done all the mistakes I could. This battle was only mistakes, only. Okay, I got a new officer, Ray. Hey, Adia. Ability, tactical weapon duration of effect created by weapons plus 50% timed effects applied on squadrons or created on the battlefield. Okay, this is not bad. Let's see the soldier. He is a soldier as well. And she is a soldier. Add one absorb shield. Okay, this is what kind of kept us alive. Something tells me that I should keep her because of her passive. I still don't have something that she could utilize, but um, as the game proceeds, maybe maybe I would I would have some something you know with uh, special effects on it. Charge ship, another church. This is no sector for a hidden die. Okay, I'm getting where this goes. Oof, okay. There is an officer on the hull that gives a shield, that's bad. Then it's an officer on squadrons. Cool down, if fully charged, spawns one crafted drone. Okay, and he plays with the impaler. Okay. Our projectile dealing 16 damage to the ship battles to the enemy battleship no matter the distance. Okay, uh, this needs to get destroyed first and the frigate. I have the destabilizer, matter destabilizer. I, they have an engine disruptor, moving speed. Okay, they have executioner and the hull breaker. I'm so dead. Let's 
Jetzt gaan we laaf. Jump there and uh, auto crafting field, sponsor. Okay, and I need drones here. Okay, what about the fighters? Okay, let's go. Ooh. Okay, yeah. I knew that would happen. <laughs> uh, forget Mark Three. Okay, and this is a. Uh, Forget them clear as well. Okay, we need drones. I'm not sure if I can get control. No, I will just die. Okay. Squadrons are very, very weak. <laughs> Not happening. Okay, if I do it now, it will absorb it, so I cannot. I have to wait. Okay. 
I hope you didn't notice that I destroyed myself. I really hope so. Okay, so they need Okay, I'm not sure how to take control over another unit. I'm really not sure. Okay, prototype frigate mark three. Not sure what's that? I want it. doing very very bad I seriously need an upgrade to my squadrons okay the artifacts in this planet are planetary defense turret records a battleship records and uh, the best officer is this one. He will return. She will return safely. She will get something from fifty percent to ninety-one percent of the resources back. Uh, and most importantly, she will lose zero to three commandos. So this is uh, my officer of choice. Let's go. This is where three guys are going to die. We found the records, okay. Okay, we just got one out of two. Whatever. Collided resources, crap. Okay. Yeah, continue going. consider a success I mean given their words why not mm. local let's go to the to the outpost picking up a recorded message from the beacon must be pre sat down looking to make a difference in your empire Looking for a well-paid career with lifelong benefits and prestige just like me? Then look no further, sign up today at your local recruitment facility and join the fleet. The time has come for you to make a difference. Yeah, that's true. If there are... Oh, we can heal them. But I have no officer to heal, so... Okay. And buy some fuel. 
Uh, replace some commandos. See the spy. This officer is tac tactical deployment increases squadrons deploy zone. This is not bad at all. Mm. Squadron spin 10% more visible and 35% when this is no, I cannot give Yuki. I love him. Battlefield auto crafter a fully charged, spawns one crafted drone, same as uh, Mark with 20 health points. Ah, uh, same Mark, yes. A non crafted squadron there. Uh, okay, and Nicola Stavros. This is a soldier. Okay, we're not going to buy, buy any officers, but. Heavy nuke, is a heavy nuke, and I mean, you know, apply decay for 25 seconds. Can't say no to that as well. So, okay, this is 150, and if I want to take it, I have to pay this one. So, uh, either I will <laughs> upgrade the weapons or take, okay, I will upgrade the weapon, I won't buy it. Or should I? Well, I cannot be an admiral without a heavy nuke. I'm a pacifist, so you know, but uh, the nuke will ensure the peace in the galaxy. Okay, we are done here. Farm up. Yeah, I don't like it. Maybe my plan is a very bad one to do the the route, the route like that. CV at twelve o'clock, sir. We are in space, there is no 12 o'clock, but whatever. Good thing we happened by, Admiral. Yeah, I see another human. Uh, other ships might have told the scrappers you were in this system. Know what I mean? Yeah. I really don't like that they do not have the choice not to annihilate them because they're straightforward blackmailing me right now i don't have the money so sorry Heavy nukes, not just nukes. Yay, no, no fuel as well. Okay, whatever. So, uh, we have a planet with an abandoned factory. We have an army depot and uh, an identified signal. Let's go to the planet. Civilian ship. Who knew would be ever be happy to see the likes of you? Thank you. We are a group of prisoners who have escaped our prison station by building a crude junk ship. Prisoners of the Empire. Captain, you're lucky you haven't started firing. Yeah, man, uh, just, just don't say shit like that. You should have fired to the previous guys, not this one. Yeah, we're likely to be flying around the hop made ship, a bunch of convicts in a post apocalyptic galaxy. You have no idea how lucky. <laughs> yeah, the iron is stronger than this one. Look, we don't want any trouble, Admiral. We know we could never beat you with our junk ship. We just want to help you and your crew. 
We know the scrapper weapon around here that's unguarded and will tell you where it's one condition. Okay, you give us neon and when the empire is returned to its former glory, you pardon for us. You you pardon us for our crimes. Okay, two conditions. I'm an imperial admiral captain, not imperial judge. That's true. Actually, now I'm everything. And if I am the only imperial around. Okay, but you're at least put us in a good way for us, so what's gonna be? Okay, uh, so I pay to fuel to get something that might not exist. Okay. Ask the prisoners about their crimes. If you haven't committed any crimes, Admiral, you will find nothing but innocent men and women on this junk ship. Every last one of us was falsely, falsely imprisoned. Yeah. Well, you don't help him much, though, do you? So, what's gonna be? We have a deal? Don't do the deal and let the prisoners go. Don't do the deal and arrest the prisoners. Okay, if I go, get to arrest them, maybe they... No, I uh, could force them to tell me. Really? Don't tell me you believe Imperial law exists even now when the machines are down. Uh, prisoner Captain. The Imperial law exists because my character exists. Yeah. Oh, he said the same. I'm the same guy. I'm not proud of it though. I feel bad for you, Admiral, living in a fantasy world like you do. Yeah, okay. But look, I surrender. I'd be foolish not to. Besides, freedom in a galaxy that's dying isn't really my idea of freedom anyway. We'll take the beds and hot meals in your brick. Yeah. The weapon. Okay, normally if you arrest them, you can, you know, make them speed it out. We've already did that once. Whatever. Look at that. No red. Okay. Uh... Peggy here seems to be okay with the mission. She will lose. She will not lose any commandos, and she will just get something between thirty-five and sixty-three percent of the resources, and she will get to come back. I think, yeah, this is my choice. Zero and ten, zero and eight, four and nine. Okay, yes, of course. Yes, please. some scrap she avoided the danger yes of course continue you're doing great so far if you do the trick here you, she didn't yeah near oh just loves you really I did scraps to any of the commandos, not to her, and she got back with scraps and fuel. Best officer. Okay, so um, this will need some scrap in order to buy things, so I will go to the identified first. Maybe there are some scrap there. 
Maybe not. If you are looking for supplies, you've come to the wrong place, Admiral. We're fresh out. This is an Esodicius not looking for assistant. I think you won't help from us then. That'd be a first. Oh, ask about the planet, ask about the day of the shutdown, ask how your ship can help the colony. Let's ask about the planet. It used to be a planet for Aki Omni Factories Admiral. Hundreds of thousands worked here, making machines, following the orders. Uh, it wasn't highly paid work, but it was honest. I know the nobles paid and looked down on us, but we took pride in it. We bled for those machines. Okay, you look decent guy. We're not struggling, struggling to survive between all the diseases and the starvation. Every day is a battle. Okay, one more about the shutdown, and then we ask how to help them. How, how can we help them? I, uh, it was a day like any other. One moment there were buildings and construction and constructing the omnis, and the next everything was strangely quiet, just like the pandemic here. Uh, our former were omnis, and they just slumped over. No warning, no nothing. At first we thought, okay, just a minor setback. They will return again, turn on again. There are omnis after all. Uh, all we have to do is wait. But one day turned to another and then another, and that was 20 years ago. Okay. Our food and resources have never been so low, he had to say, but unless something changes, and soon we are goners. Okay, how can I help you? Honestly, I'm not sure you can, but we could always use some scrap. They need level scrap, I'm already low on scrap, so yeah, just take it. He was a a decent guy, he didn't fuck around with me, but we got a battleship weapon. Oh, and I found the weapon they were looking, they, they were hiding. Look at that! I paid like 11 scrap to get a Mark III weapon. Throw something good and it will come back, or something like that, I don't really no. Um, okay, what does stop movement, attacks, and ability charging of units on targeted cells? Okay, it's not bad. Okay, just keep it there. Okay, here is a station. I can buy stuff from here, but I don't have the scrap. So my idea is just to ignore the station because I will just save one fuel, one neon. Uh, yeah, no need for that. Okay, we are here. I'm going here, but... Uh, yeah, I did a very bad planning. They will, uh, enemies will be here as well. We will have to battle. And this is exactly what will happen. I have to go there. But you sure the scrapper forces have caught up with us? Yeah, figured. Our leads will finally good. Time to bust up the shining ship of yours. Mom will be so happy. Maybe she'll let us personally drain her boils. Maybe she will let us personally drain her boils? Okay, just before we start, we will go for a very short, short break and be right back.
let's see massive asteroids block access to the cell okay maybe i could use this to my advan advantage with uh, the juggernaut uh, i want those things here they have fighters and uh, exploding Okay, where is the long wall? There have only one fighter, it's a uh, officer. She's a scientist. Maria Cho. Maria Cho, okay. Auxiliary system, squadron, dog recovery twice as fast, but they start with low hit points. And they have two hulls of 50. Let's go. Can I jump? What happened? <laughs> Are uh, they were the exploding things? Okay, chain reaction. Let's see what happens here. Fuck. <laughs> okay, didn't see that coming. No, you can't. Here and let's try this one. the first core blaster can only oh the same shit come on really <laughs> just look at it just look at it. Okay, come back here. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I'm almost finished the battle and the <laughs> nuke hasn't... Uh, Got uh, fuel, why not? Oh, does that mean that I've lost the mission? Because I cannot do do it like anything. I think I've lost it. Okay, uh, I stop them in that system so they won't spread. Yeah, in RD. Fuck. Come on now, I'm disappointed. 
As to complain, I hate to complain while we're twiddling our thumbs down here looking for a bit of direction. Anything in particular you'd like to work us on? I mean, like anything? Build a squadron, harden the ship's hull, develop a new weapon, harden the ship's hull now. I just gave you man, give them a go ahead. Okay. Sir, our hull has officially been strengthened, I feel useful again. Praise Oberon. Yeah, what happened to the hull? Um, the hull seems the same. I mean the same oh they they gave us one one here no they didn't hard and hard Mmm, that was another mistake. This run goes smoothly. I mean, I did like everything wrong. <laughs> okay, whatever. Just lost some scraps. Hey, but we get to fuel to neon. An omniforts. No idea. Let's go find out. Civilian ship. Looking for a good tech? I got kind of good tech. All legally procured, of course, of course. What are the chance that actually works? Good, very good, 75% good. Okay, buy a ground defense signal upgrade. Buy squadron dog recovery upgrade. Buy fuel scavenging upgrade. I think there is no more fuel scavenging upgrade. Buy a navigational scanner upgrade. I will go squadron recovery. Testing it so the tech has locked to determine. Okay, I hope it works. Checks out. Okay. All my tech work 75% of the time. <laughs> okay, that was cheap. Okay. Uh, I think this cost like 80 and we did it with 25. So it's a win. Visit Omniforge. That's nice. Ooh. Here is the upgrade. Okay, it goes up to eighty five hit points. It increases a bit the damage, accelerate uh, while moving in a straight line, deals up to 10 damage upon impact. Okay, it's not, it's not much of an upgrade though. Fighters, let's see this one. 5 hit points goes to 7. 7 DPS and nothing else ok this deals 100 damage instead of 90 when uh, it uh, collides with a battleship and 
50. Okay. A bit more damage. Yeah, I use them. Maybe I. Sh oh, you just click it. Okay. Great the uh, the fighter It doesn't uh, this does six damage this does five damage okay I will uh, I will upgrade the ghost no it needs two and this needs one It's the new one, Frigate Mark 3 prototype, apply decay to current target. Oof. Needs 4, I cannot upgrade that. I mean, I don't have that much. Okay, I'll just make this one go to 2. And we're go okay. We have 6 more to jump. Oof. I am identified, let's go check there. I'll be honest with you, Admiral, I'm gonna need a good reason not to end you. Mateo Zenakis. Try to make a deal with the pirate. Say you are trying to turn on the Omni back on. Offer the pirate a chance to surrender. Yeah, I will go with this one. I mean, my ego cannot stand the other two choices. He's <laughs> are but you better pray you don't run to me again, I'll bounce back from this. Okay, Mateo. Okay, Mateo, give us some scrap. Okay. Oof. We are here, we failed horribly. Let's... Okay, are we all there? Me and the scrappers? It's mother's battleship, sir, and this cluster's folder. What? Mother? Incoming transmission. Ooh. So, this mother has playthings? Scrappers trying to have fun with, and she has uh, the breeders or what? Child bears? I'm not sure how they call them. So she can produce more scrappers. Yeah, mother, look at you in your shiny tails. Battleship so cute. Uh, as first admiral of the empire in the name of Oberon, I demand, demand, you demand nothing, admiral. I do not know what hole you've been hiding in, but we are free from now, old man Oberon and his metallic gods. We'll restore this sector once more to the natural state, mother, whether you surrender or not. Whether I surrender, you are too much, not much longer will be my plaything. <coughs> Just kill me, please. Can't wait to get close to you. I can't wait. Ah, <laughs> no. uh, 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 am I fighting mother? Really? Okay. So, mother has uh, 100. Four plates of 100 points each. Um, she has a f an officer. Core Blaster Mark III. Can only target unlight units. Fuck, I hate this gun. Okay. 
the call to arms. Every 80 seconds, three incoming enemy reformance units are added to the battlefield. Yeah. Uh, I'm ready. Juggernaut, of course. Those guys here. Where is the ghost guys? Okay, ghost guys here, juggernaut here, and you here. It's not going to work as intended. No, 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 no. Here and then here. I'm not sure why you follow that, but okay. Hmm. Fighters. Okay. Okay, as well. Whatever. Isn't so easy to die. Okay, second blade down. I'm really impressed on how Mother is, is so easy so far to get hit. No special ability. the first time mm, this is bad yeah this is the first time it dies come on go 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 we need this one and which is the magneto okay magneto should be here this should be here. Okay, they did their magic. Okay. 
Okay. Let's see if, I, if this can do it. Okay. The nuke is ready. Fine, I liked it. <laughs> I'm not sure if I will make it though. Let's try this again. here to protect, stay here to protect. Ooh. Okay, it's funny, I always thought I'd die from my neon poisoning, not that the handsome Imperial Admiral in the post-imperial universe. Uh, this should have been right. Finish me off, Admiral, what are you waiting for? So... Ask why she terrorized these sectors. Ask why she why she shut the omnis down in these sectors. Ask if she knows anything about you. Okay, that's some interesting questions. Okay, I will fulfill my ego first because I'm the best admiral in there, out there. Actually, the only. Do you know who I am? I do not <laughs> imperial, nor do I care. I have other questions, does you shine? Uh, why is she shut down the Omnis? Why is she shut down the Omnis of the other room? The Omnis, that's all anyone wants to talk about. Why not talk about the injustice the Empire created, the absurdity of a system that revolved around pieces of metal? Surely you remember, Admiral, that the cause of the Omni was more than a person like me? There's more than a person like me, a miner, could make in a lifetime, why would to talk about that instead? But as much as you want to think, I shut the omens down and know how to turn them back on again, I didn't and I don't. Okay, so the problem is another guy, another enemy, I benefited when they crashed, yes, but I didn't crash them myself. How can you expect me to believe you, a thief and a slave and a murderer? Believe what you want, Admiral, it makes no difference to me. Ask who or what did shut them. I can't say, and to be honest, I don't care. Besides, if I knew something, why wouldn't I tell you? Because we are dying, all of us, noble or not, and we don't turn the machines on soon, it will be too late. Maybe humans should die, Admiral, every single one of us. No. On the second thought, I will offer you a clue, I never liked them anyway. <laughs> The church of the singularity, just like your kind, they do have spread lies and made uh, many false promises. Yeah. As it seems, I'm not so with the good guys, but um, I still have to take it. Just after the shutdown, I tortured a visionary trapped in the sectors. Oh, I did too. He told me the church had a plan to free the Omnis. It was his uh, opinion that it succeeded, succeeded in doing so. Why did he tell you this? He was desperate. He thought telling me might save his life. He did not. <laughs> Why would the Church of Singularity want to free the machines? I don't know, Admiral. That's for you to figure out. You have other questions to do. Okay. Why you did terrorize the sector? Do you have any idea what life was like before the shutdown? You nobles with the, your arms, you never did care how the other 99% lived, you didn't care because we were the ones who did the dirty job, a job in your minds and factories that you believed were too far beneath you and your precious beloved machines. 
I did the jobs and everything. Okay, now I have to sympathize with the mother now that I killed her. And so did my parents and their parents before them. Your kind promise has changed to be rich, a, ch a chance to be rich, a chance to own an only one day, a chance to rise. Lies. Nothing about lies. Okay, and all that lies where a bomb would go off, that bomb went off the day the home shut down. I'm sure you did not live as you dreamed. Okay, this game is a roguelike. But the kind of story it plays right now, it's just. Uh, it's, it tickles you to care a bit more. You're right, it does, but I can say the violence. When I started, I discovered I like it. You have other questions? Okay, no, I don't. Today is as good as uh, as any other day. You will beat them in other sector are safe once more. Wait, I just remember the omnis are still down. We are still stuck in the other end because we don't have an omni to use this folder. You are trapped here, and <laughs> your crew will die from starvation or disease, just like everyone else. Guess what? Your wrong. Imperial ships and omnis will arrive. Mother Auburn will see to it. Wait, are you telling me you think there are active omnis in clusters beyond this one? What do you mean? Uh, the omnis have shut down like everywhere? <laughs> yeah. I don't believe you, they would mean uh, other imperial clusters are chaotic and violent as this one. They probably are. If there were active omnis, don't you think they could have fixed the fault net by now? It's been 20 years. Your empire is finished, that man. Oh, sorry, Admiral, I'm not going to let that happen. I've spent most of my life controlled by Imperial forces. I refuse to die that way too. Okay, fair. Oof. Okay, we are not able because we don't know the way, but the people that are out there are safer for what we have done. Yeah, they will still die. As Caliban, if he believes the church could be behind the shutdown, if he believes the Omnis have shut down in all Imperial sectors, as Caliban who or what most likely shut down the machines, try to recall again an emotionally linked memory. What did I tell you about your emotional linked memories, Admiral? You must be patient, they will return when they are ready to return. I don't like this answer. As the previous Calvin told you, we are, we are not private to the biographical information of the clones, no matter how juicy such information might be. Okay, uh, let's ask him if he believes that the church is behind everything. Apparently it's not. I do, yes, the church was powerful organization with billions of believers. Okay, call me Grace, but I believe Mother demented story about missionary. Uh, dude, the mother didn't seem any demented at all. She was just infuriated with us. I also don't believe the scrappers were capable of shutting down the omens down themselves. They seem to have been a rather small time outfit. Yeah, mother was intelligent. Okay, so the first sector is scrappers, the second is the church. We could use the folder to access the cluster, but as mother said, we don't have a machine. We can do, we can do that. Uh, Ask about the percent of the population believed in the church. 
I'm not sure why I care about that, but I will ask it either way. 99% before the Admiral, before the shutdown, I do not know the numbers now. Uh, the non-believers were usually, but not always, the wealthiest of, in the Empire, the members of three major houses. So they were some friends, counter-cultural groups, okay. Because they weren't the only one who owned the Omnis, as Mother said, the only one who could afford to, and you own something. Even if it's vastly superior to you in every way, I'd imagine it's difficult to see as godly. Okay, so the church uh, made the omnis uh, sound sound as gods for most people, except the one person that actually could own an omni, such as myself. And they could see that they are no gods. Uh, ask about no, I don't care about the three major house. I know enough. Try not to forget it. What do you want to do now? If all the machines are shut down, I'm not sure why Caliban still, uh, is still operational. Maybe Caliban did it. <laughs> As Caliban who or what most likely shut down the machines? A human, a group of humans. Somehow they accessed the alumni, not including me. That makes you suspicious, Caliban. Clever move, move by Ober not to connect the Calibans to the Fallen at other way. Oh, uh, otherwise, all Omnis would have shut down. So, Calibans is a species, but as embracing as it is at me, they don't know who access the Omnis nor now nor how at this time. Yeah, just end the conversation. We're trapped, we can use the folder. Not without the folder Omni, even without the tribe here before us. Don't worry about that, I should have said something. I can get this folder to work. If I was to investigate, what happened? I would start from my robot to take us to a hub where we can find the folder to protect. To project us in the chart the church cluster. But you are not a folder only. No, but like I was saying, Ober anticipated an apocalyptic scenario in the pyre and modified my capabilities to match the scenario. Bullshit. This is what it is. So just like I have some super cube functionality, I can also use the folders. But because I'm not real, folder, omni, there are limits to what I can project. Cut the crap. Only the matter currently to be handled database would mean we will have to start at square one on the other side of the folder with our ship and crew. Oh, what? We have to start at square one on the other side of the folder with our ship and crew. I get to keep my crew, right? They're telling me we will have to start from scratch. It's time. No, why? I love them. Also, now that we have pacified the cluster, we can safely and speedily return to Gehenna to change our ship and specialist officer if you'd like. Okay, so the game suggests that every time that you finish of a sector, you go back to Gehenna, remake your ship, and then go to the So perhaps you feel that certain improvements can be... Uh, I don't know, I don't want to ask about fault. No, I want to ask. 
use projection or reconstruction technology with the proper omnis we can one can project almost endless amount of information in another cluster in the glory days of the empire behemoth omnis were used for this purpose personally personality less if you ask me but they were good at their job they must have been among the first omnis to be scrapped after the shutdown poor behemoth omnis yeah continue with the church Just look at that, come on, it's perfect. Ooh, okay. Yep. Ooh. New battleship unlocked, chaos class, chaos class. Battles will now be available at the startup. Congratulations! We did it, guys, in normal though, but uh, it's still we did chapter one. Okay, I will have to check uh, which one I use. Uh, start a new run. If I go to main menu. Can I change class of my ship and uh, whatever? Okay, this is something I will find out in the next one. Uh, I think this is it for today. So thank you very much for being here with me. Uh, until next time. See ya.